As more and more people look to streamline their entire web presence, we frequently get asked how to set up a portfolio using Profoto. Of course, there are tons of plugins, external sites, and third-party tools available, but here I'll focus on creating a portfolio using just the built-in Profoto options. One method is to create portfolio pages that are accessible via a drop-down from the menu. To begin, create new WordPress pages, not posts, for each different set of images you want to showcase as a portfolio. Then you upload the images and insert them into each page, either directly or as one or more Profoto galleries. To create a page, go to Pages Add New, and there type in the title you want to use. This will be my Weddings Portfolio page. To upload images, click the Upload link, select your images from their location on your computer, and upload them all at once. Once they've all uploaded, if you want to insert them all directly so viewers can scroll through them, then click Insert All Images. And here's what that looks like. If you want to display them in a Profoto gallery, then click New Profoto Gallery from Images. From there, you order your images, name your gallery, select the slideshow or lightbox options that you want to apply, and click one of the insert buttons. I'm going to insert a slideshow gallery that starts automatically. And here's what that page looks like. You'll want to create a separate page for each portfolio category you want to feature. As an example, I've created portfolio pages titled Weddings, Family, and Fashion. The next step is to create the menu links that connect to these pages. To do this, I go to the Profoto menu customization area and create a new menu item called Portfolio. I want it to be a container link for links to my portfolio page, so I edit the link and select that link type. Then I create three new menu items for my three portfolio pages. I set each link to internal blog links and specific WordPress page, and then in the drop-down, choose my portfolio pages. Then you name your link and click to save changes. After you've done this for all of your portfolio pages, click and drag the new links into your portfolio container. Now you have a portfolio menu item that is a drop-down list of links to all of your different portfolio galleries pages. For a variation on this process, you can set your menu items to link to specific Profoto gallery instead. Then you can set your gallery to display in one of the following ways. A slideshow gallery in a pop-up window, a full screen slideshow in a pop-up window, a slideshow in its own page, a slideshow loaded into a slide down. Now a menu link set to appear as slide down content will cause the content of the gallery or page to slide down below the header on the page when you click the link. Clicking the link again slides the content back up on that same page. Other options are a lightbox gallery loaded into that same kind of slide down, or a lightbox gallery in its own page. 
There is a second option available to you that takes advantage of the ProPhoto Grids feature. With this method, you start by creating a new blank WordPress page called Portfolio. Then in that page, insert a galleries grid that displays image links to the galleries you choose. Again, here you have different options for how you want the gallery to display. Select the rest of your grid options, including which specific galleries you want to link to. Click to insert the grid, and then publish the page. Back in the ProPhoto menus area, you link then to just that one page. That gives you a portfolio menu link that links to the WordPress page Portfolio. And once a viewer clicks on the link to go to that page, they see a grid of your galleries and can click on the grid to open a specific gallery, like this. It's pretty popular to insert this kind of portfolio galleries grid right in the static home page. That way, when people land on your home page, those attractive grid image links entice them to click through and view a sampling of your best work. Here's an example of what something like that looks like. These are two simple, attractive methods to quickly create a portfolio area on your ProPhoto site. However, there are other options. For example, you can create text, grid, or image links to portfolio pages or galleries in any of the widget areas. The next video addresses some of these additional portfolio ideas.